coming to Miami and living in the city of Miami, I think you can lose track of um, what diversity or what strides we've made um, within diversity to get to where we are today. Um, University of Miami is really no stranger to that. And, you know, it wasn't until they did this program that I really understood how young the African-American presence is at the University of Miami. 1961 is, is just our parents' generation, right? Um, so I think that it really gives us perspective on, on the strides that we've made and the strides that we need to continue to make uh, and not really put our foot off the, off the gas pedal. Um, so I think the fact that they're doing this now and recognizing the efforts that those before us made is a really important step for us to recognize uh, all the, the efforts that they made for us to be where we are and for us to continue to carry that torch forward. The thing about the University of Miami is it's as great as you make it. So this school is a private institution. At the time when I was here, it was 9,000 students undergrad and grad. Uh, and they allowed you to, it was a blank, blank slate. You could be as in, involved actively or passively as you wanted to. Um, and, and there were endless opportunities. So that really had no bearing on your, your racial background, your uh, uh, any demographic really, so to speak. So um, I think that using that platform that the university provided and parlaying that into your professional lives is a huge advantage if you just continue to apply the same things that you've learned here um, into your real life. So, and I think that my, my fondest memory uh, is a collection of the relationships that I built on campus. Um, the people that I met from day one are still very close friends of mine right now. A group of students that I became friends with at the University of Miami are now my closest friends with me in New York. Uh, one of them is going to be the godson, godfather to my daughter. Um, so these relationships are not just flash in the pan. These are lasting relationships that span all sorts of different realms. Um, so when you when you take all of the material stuff away. You know, and, and all of the, the parties that everybody was a part of or, or the, the scenes and the unforgettable memories of the various classrooms and running from one building to the next, you know, those are all memories that you kind of carry with you. But the people really are things that you will uh, have with you infinitely. So uh, I think it's the relationships. No, I love coming back here. UM's always been my home since I was five years old. So I'm, I'm glad to see the direction that it's heading and uh, op I'm optimistic about the future of the school. So.